Hey, 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 what it do, baby? You're, it's Monday, and that means another video from the degenerate demon himself. And yo, today I'm gonna show you guys how to unlock Forge World in Halo Reach PC with unlimited budget and also a bunch of vehicles and scenery that isn't in normal Forge. So let's get right into this video, cuties. All right, everybody. Thank you so much for helping me to hit 100 subscribers. That's super awesome. I'm gonna be dropping that video where I show you guys all out tomorrow. But the thing is, after I got 100 subs, it started ramping up and I got like 30 subs in a day. So it's a little bit hard to keep up with. If you guys want a shout out, make sure to hit that like and subscribe button if you guys like the content, of course. And if you need help with anything, drop me a comment down below. Also, I'm dropping a video this week and I need your help. Basically, I need one of you guys to join one of my lobbies, play a couple games with me. It's going to be super fun. You know, I always make things fun. I can't do this alone. I would get one of my friends, but I think it's going to be a lot more fun if one of my community members joins me and does this with me. So if you want to be a part of my next video, make sure you're subscribed to me, of course, like the video, and comment down below with your gamer tag. And basically, if you get a message on Xbox Live from somebody called Demon is Raw, it's the kid. And uh, we'll set up a date to make this video. So I'd really appreciate it. On with the tutorial. Alright, so first things first, go ahead and make a new folder on your desktop. Name it Halo Reach PC Mod or Forge Mod or whatever you want to call it. Just make sure you remember what it is. Then you're going to head to the link in the description, which is a mega download link. You're going to download Forge Halo All Forge .rar. This is the mod that basically allows you to have unlimited budget, etc. Then you're also going to want to download this hex tool. Don't worry, no viruses, nothing like that. It's the kid you're talking to. You're not going to get any viruses from anything that I show you guys in any video. All the links are going to be in the description. It's going to be really easy for you. Download both of those. And drag the RARs into your Halo Reach Forge mod folder. You're also going to need WinRAR for this, pretty sure that's self-explanatory. Head over to your SSD or wherever Halo and your Steam games are located. Go to SSD, Program Files, x86, then Steam, Steam Apps, Common, Halo the Master Chief Collection, MCC, Content, Packs, and you're going to copy this file, and you're going to head back. And you're going to make a new file in the main Halo Master Chief Collection library. Call it Backup. This is just so that if you make any mistakes or anything, you don't screw up your game, you know? Paste that Halo pack file into your... Uh, it's a Windows No Editor pack into the Backups file. That's the original. Remember that. Then what you're going to do is you're going to open up your HXD, which is the hex tool that you downloaded going to install obviously you want to say yes okay next accept the agreement sign your life away now you can create a desktop shortcut if you want yeah, that desktop shortcut if you want you don't have to and launch hex editor now you're going to go to file open you're going to go back into your ssd or wherever like i said your steam games are all saved Program files x86. Steam. Steam apps. Common. Halo the Master Chief Collection. And you're going to head back into MCC. Don't go into backup. That's not what you want to do here. That's backup file should not be touched. Content. Packs. And you're going to open that Windows No Editor pack. Now what you're going to want to do is click Control G. Not control F, control G. Then you're gonna paste this hex file. I'll put it up on the screen now. And it's gonna show you a hex line with two zeros on it. You wanna change these two zeros, these exact ones that it finds for you, to 27. Now you're gonna press control G again. And you're gonna edit these zeros to 27 as well with this hex code. There's two different hex codes, two different lines that you need to edit, and you just need to change the two zeros to 27. Save that file. And you can exit out of that now. That's, that's completely done.
Then you're going to open up Steam. Don't open up Master Chief Collection directly. Open up Steam. Then click play. And you're going to want to enter the second one. So play Halo MCC Anti-Cheat Disabled Mods Unlimited. I don't think you can get banned for this, but I would just recommend, you know, playing it with the mods disabled. Or sorry, the mods enabled just so that you're safe. See, and now you have create under your Halo Reach lobby menu. And yeah, yeah. I'm recording this in one take, so give me a break here, guys. So we're going to open up Forge World. And there you have it, you are in Forge World, but you only have 10,000 budget and a lot of the vehicles are hidden like the modded vehicles and obviously you guys want those so I'm going to show you guys how to do it, basically just exit back out of Halo. Go back into your program files x86. Steam. Team apps, common, Halo the Master Chief Collection, Halo Reach, and you're going to go to maps, not map variants, maps. Now you're going to scroll down and you're going to find the one that says Halo Forge map, or Forge Halo dot map. Copy that, then you're going to go back to that backups folder I told you guys to make earlier, and you're going to paste that in there because that's the original. Now, you're going to go back to that Halo Reach file, maps again, and then you're going to open up the folder that was on your desktop that has that, has that modded map pack that I told you guys to download from Megalinks, or Mega Upload, and you're going to drag that into the program files, maps file. You're going to replace the file, so now the modded map is in your Halo Reach file. Open up Steam again. Cheat mode disabled, hit play, and there you go, you just start up Forge World or Forge whatever Forge you want. Now just a note, you are going to need a controller in order to use the monitor mode, so when you're editing you will need a controller. I don't know if PlayStation controllers or whatever work, but you guys can try it out, let me know in the comments. But I do know Halo Xbox One controllers work with Halo, so... I use that. There you guys have it. Look at the budget. 69000 Bunch of different scenery. A bunch of new stuff. You can uh, go down to Vehicles MCC. You can use the Saber. Whoa, like, look at that thing. <laughs> That's from the campaign. You can't get that in Normal Forge. Pretty crazy. You can fly it as well. The Seraph is also in it. Bunch of cool stuff. Um, one of the cool things about this map... Uh, because you have unlimited budget, they've also removed, whoever made this mod has also removed the boundaries of the map. You can literally fly, like, pretty much to space. Um, you can go anywhere, you're not gonna die. But yeah, like, I'm having a lot of fun with this Forge World, I'm probably gonna go edit a little map and fly around, screw around. Uh, pretty fun. But, what I would recommend, guys, is I would just recommend going to that backup folder and re-replacing the files and the hex codes if you want to go back and play multiplayer. Just because I'm not exactly sure if you can get in trouble for this. Let me know in the comments below, but do this at your own risk if you choose to, you know, go into multiplayer with all these files still added into your, uh, into your registry. So... That's pretty much the video. If you guys like the content, if this helped you out, if you're having fun in Forge World, let me know down below. Drop me a subscribe. Drop me a like. Love you all. Uh, and yeah, if you want to be featured in one of my next videos and help me out, drop me a comment down below with your gamer tag. And you obviously have to have Halo Reach on PC, otherwise you can't play with me. Um, and I'll pick one of you lucky people to be in my next video, so that'll be pretty cool. Anyways, thank you so much for watching. Take care, everyone. Peace, people.